all of you who believe in me and support me on this Facebook site. Um, trust me, you've all still been very much on my mind, though, I can promise you that. It's been a pretty trying three or four months for me. I still, when I wake up in the morning or Daddy. when I'm falling asleep at night, feel like I'm not over the shock and the huge letdown by the Fourth District Appellate Court and the refusal to give my give my case and stay in court. It's hard to believe that judges who have spent their professional lives in upholding the law and pursuing justice can so easily turn a blind eye to the truth. Illinois is maybe second to only Texas in wrongful convictions, and from where I'm sitting, I can see why. This message to you all today isn't going to be a rant um, about the Illinois justice system. As hard as it is for me not to do that, um, I'm just going to move on for today. Uh, I'd rather spend this time thanking all of you for helping me to get through the last few months. From the supportive comments on our Facebook site to your letters, uh, the cards, uh, and to those of you who let me run up your phone bill, I promise you, every single one, every single one of you play a, a part in, in, in giving me the strength to keep going. Um, I hope you guys know that it's not just lip service when I say that. It's absolutely 100% true. Um, and, I, and I'm grateful and I'm thankful for all of you. I'm hoping um, that it's on or near May 1st that you're hearing this message. If so, our billboard is up and running on the corner of Eastland Drive, Veterans Parkway in Bloomington. You know, I always knew I'd have my name up in lights one day. I just didn't think it'd be like this. Um, all joking aside, I think the billboard is a, is a huge deal, and we could have never done it without the help from some of you out there. Um, we, we, we received donations from all over the country, um, from Illinois and Missouri, Florida, Iowa, Georgia, California, Colorado, North Carolina, um, New Jersey, Oregon, and Tennessee, from the United Kingdom and, and, and from Canada. Um, we got, we got um, donations from David and Leslie, from um, Philip and Anne Marie, from Gracie May, from the Reverend Cecil and his wife, Sherry, from Cheryl and Leah, from Rick and Connie, uh, from Kelly, Bo, Lori, Rex, Rhonda, and Gabe from North Carolina, Luke, Hayden, Charles from the United Kingdom, Stephanie, um, from Christine Bivens and Nicole Kishin in Canada who, you know, they're, they're, they're having their own fight up there with the system in Canada to try and free uh, Christine's daughter Nikki and still they find the time to include us and I'm, I'm so grateful for you guys up there. Um, from Matthew, Raymond, Rachel and Pam, from Monica, from Tammy, Nicole, from Mary, from Lynn, um, from Leah from California, um, and from Misty. And uh, I know, Misty, that, that you played a huge role in helping us reach our goal in raising this money. I know you said I don't need to thank you, but I want to thank you anyways. I want to thank you for believing me, and I want to thank all of you for believing in me. Um, I also know uh, that there were people who wanted to donate and help raise the funds for the billboard but just didn't have the money for it. It's, it's okay. Uh, I know that you support us in this fight in other ways, so, you know, it, it's nothing to worry about. Uh, we appreciate everything that everybody does. Um, you know, and I, I, I have to thank you, Tammy. Uh, none of this would be possible without you. Not the Facebook site, not the billboard, nothing. Um, you put so much time and effort in trying to right the wrong that's been done to me and my family, and you've done it without complaint. Um, I think you know my case better than I do. Uh, I'll never be able to thank you, Tammy, with just words. But I, I'm so grateful for you, and, and I'm so thankful for everything that you do. You know, I'm, I'm really excited about this billboard, though. I just know that it has the potential to reach people who either didn't testify truthfully at my trial, or it can reach people who know something about this case. I wrote and told some of you this. But, you know, I, I've got the kind of hope that only the innocent is allowed to have. I'm able to wake up each and every day in this place and know without question or doubt that today could be the day that I get my miracle. Today can be the day that the evidence is found or the witness comes forward with the information that will set me free. That's real hope. And believe me, on the days when I lose sight of that fact and I feel like this place is pulling me down, I get a letter or a card from one of you and it snaps me right back. You know, I feel like we are all fighting the good fight. You know, this this is, uh, I feel like it's a team, you know. Um, that's 
message here by saying again to all of you,